a passion for music has led a Naperville man to learn about another culture, finding out more about himself in the process. Listen closely as Naperville News 17's Christian Canizal shares his story. The meditative tune you're hearing is coming from a Japanese flute called the shakuhachi. It's being played from inside of longtime Naperville resident Michael Furman's studio, where he practices and teaches how to play the instrument. The shakuhachi actually came to Japan from China in the 8th century with four holes in the front and one in the back, and the entire flute is made from bamboo. I got interested in it because I heard it on a record many, many years ago, and it captivated me, the sound captivated me, and I followed up trying to find one, and then eventually found one, and then found a teacher. Furman's passion for the flute grew from there. He eventually traveled to Japan to learn more about the culture of the flute's unofficial home. One of the things that, that seems to be prevalent across the board in Japanese art forms anyway is the attention to detail. They're incredibly detailed oriented people. I think it, it, it taught me to, to, to pay attention more than anything else I think. That attention to detail is needed to play the instrument because unlike traditional flutes the shakuhachi doesn't have a fipple which means you have to create the sound with head movements and lip placement. So you, you have a lot of flexibility and it gives it its uh, its own unique quality and it, it's very expressive in that way. He reads the sheet music up and down and if a note is bigger the tone is lower and vice versa. Another distinct characteristic is the headgear people wear sometimes while playing which allows listeners to focus more on the music and not the musician. This is called a, a tengai and it was worn by mendicant um, monks uh, in the Edo period and they roamed around the land uh, playing the shakuhachi, wearing an outfit that included this tengai, and they wore it for anonymity. Furman is able to see through the front slits, but it's difficult seeing him. He's mastered the art of playing the flute, becoming a certified shakuhachi teacher, and he's even joined an ensemble. There's an eclectic world of music out there, and I think what the big takeaway should be is that uh, there's all sorts of things to, to absorb. Shakuhachi being one of them. For Naperville News 17, I'm Christian Canizal. Furman will have a solo performance and lecture about the Shakuhachi in Chicago. You can learn more by visiting his Facebook page.